the meantime, the users have responded on YouTube that the sound is a little bit off. So in each video, I'll use another setting and I hope this one will be a lot, a lot better already. So Variety is there to give us these no nice wallpapers. That's easy peasy. We have around 60 videos about Variety. It provides us wallpapers, that's it. Topic of this video is the waybar. The waybar is the one that we've chosen. There is also the panel that we used to have in the beginning when we started developing panel from Wayfire, right? So it's always about choices all the time. And this particular waybar is gonna be the default. That means that you go to the folder Wayfire, .config Wayfire, in here, everything read, read it all, right? We have the way bars that are coming from here till here. And we have the scripts folder that's going to launch the way fires. Way bar, sorry. <laughs> All right. There are way fire way bars alternatives. There's folder, I mean, a file, I mean. And when does that kick in? What, how should we go change the way bar? Well, first of all, what you see is in here. So whatever you go change in here, voila, okay? Now I wouldn't do that, not unless uh, if you use scale like we do all the time. And if you want to change something, you actually create a new one. Control C, Control V, and you call it Waybar Mine or something. Something nice and catchy, right? A name, Waybar Mine. Then you say to the scripts, look, the status bar is the default one. That's the one with du dual monitors left and right. That's the one imported from Hyperlink. That's the one imported from Hyperlink. That's the one imported from Hyperlink. That's what you found online, GitHub, Kartika, and that's the one from the state from Rava, right? So all things that are online, you can use the code. And of course, it will be not 100% perfect. And then you change the code and then you have your own bar that you take around with you on anything we need, right? Waybar, Hyperlink, Wayfire, Sway, go ahead. So we have created ours an, a new bar, copy paste, right? Actually, it's a new one. And we gonna copy paste this as well here. That's how we launch the default. We're gonna call this just for simplicity's sake, also mine. So if I go and look at the code, it says go to the home, to the config, to the waybar, to the waybar, no, to the waybar mine. And indeed to the waybar mine. Done. Of course it's not applied yet, but everything is ready to be applied. Status bar is launched in a file in the dot config in the way far way fire ini you can click a lot of um, custom key bindings but one of those i like is super five super and key binding keypad five in the middle there right then it just maximizes or i can drag it and drop it to the sides right whatever you want so go check out the custom key bindings the thing is, we have here the bar, the status bar. This can be called anything, right? It doesn't really matter. I don't think it allows spaces. But for the rest, it doesn't really matter. But for our sake, it's maybe a better to call it mine or something, right? So it's the same reference. And here as well, go to mine. No, not that one. Status bar mine. So this one, we want to launch, well, we launch something and, and this can be anything, but it just refers to the thing we're going to do, right? Start status bar mine, config way bar script status bar mine. Now I am recording, first of all, save, quit. I need to go and kill the way bar and then open it up again. So 
this is something you don't do normally you just log out log in and you got your own wave bar now at this point in time i won't see a difference right i won't see a difference at all so maybe it's better that i just quickly change some things around like for instance i don't like these modules up there right so you say fine the modules they are in the config thingy the disk and the memory is just too crowded for me just the menu is fine i don't like network to be there i don't want to do that pulse audio i have powerful control i have powerful control control alt u it's there save control alt u i set everything i want don't need a button up there there is a key binding control alt u clock is there fine tray custom firewall that's it that's what i want to keep okay you do a save you do a quit and then i need to launch this again so this one is launched with a script that's called status bar mine i just open a terminal you can put these guys next to each other and then status bar mine and off it goes killing one and replacing with the other so this is what i want to have this is our choice this is our status bar we've made a new status bar not really but yeah really this is your thing and if you do a scale it doesn't matter because it will get overwritten at all so that's one of the first videos about the way bar so we've created we've, we've created a new one on the basis of one of ours right okay next video we'll just switch with the one that we have already